Hi everyone, welcome to Basic Panda. In today's video, we will see the latest feature recently launched by Microsoft and that is the notifications. We used to have notifications entity in Dynamics 365 but recently we have got so many modifications like now we will be able to generate notifications so that it will be popped up to user. There is a notification panel uh, given by Dynamics. So with the help of this new feature, we can easily generate notifications within Model Driven App. So in this video series, I'll be creating and showing you some notifications. We will see how we can enable notifications. We can add styles, like we can add bold, a new line, how we can generate, a, uh, how we can add a URL inside a notification. So uh, let's start with this video. First of all, I have created a trial instance and before we go into that, I just wanted to let you know that I have created this blog and in this I have mentioned all the points related to this, like how we can enable, how we can generate, how we can add styles. So you can also check everything here in my blog, but in this video we will see everything step by step. So let's start. So I have created a trial instance for this. So first point is we will see how we can enable the notifications. So for this we have to go to the maker portal. So I have opened the maker portal. Let me go to my dev instance. Uh, I have created one solution. So I will just open that solution. So we have to basically decide that in which model driven app uh, sorry in which application we have to enable the notification feature so example here I want to enable the notification feature inside my customer service workspace app so if you see this is the icon and these are kind of notifications that we are going to generate so this notifications I haven't done any customization but with this new feature if you are going to enable the notifications in any app you will see this by itself so we are going to see how I have enabled it so this is done I have opened the solution I have added my app inside this so you have to go edit and preview you will see the settings option you can click that come to upcoming action and then here this is the uh, uh, button that we have to enable so I have enabled it in app notifications currently this is in preview mode and uh, this is how we can enable it I have just already saved it so that's how after refreshing I got this enabled here so we have enabled the notification we have seen how this tab will look like so this is basically a notification panel and here we will see all the notifications so this part is done now we will move to our next part in my next video where we will see how we can create a notification so in that we will just take a small example and then we will start with our notification generation so thank you